Hey, welcome back lawn lovers, BW here. Hey, it's fall now, so let's do a little leaf mulching. It's October 23rd today. The trees are near full color now and just beginning to drop their leaves. I have a red maple tree that really isn't very colorful in the fall, but it's dropping its leaves now. The leaves from this tree dry out very quickly and become very brittle, making them very easy to mulch into the lawn with the mower. I think I must have heard and read about a million times that mulching leaves into your lawn is good for the soil. But is it good for the grass? Trees compete with grass for nutrients, water, and sunlight. Sure, mulching the leaves returns most of those nutrients to the soil, but did you know that some trees and their leaves produce chemicals that are meant to prevent other plants like grass from growing underneath them? It's like a form of chemical warfare to eliminate competition for food and water. That makes me wonder if I'm really doing my lawn any favors by mulching the leaves. The scientific term for this is allelopathy. I've read in the past that oak trees are one of the trees that produce chemicals intended to kill the grass. So I've been collecting my neighbor's oak leaves from my lawn over the past couple of years while mulching my maple leaves. I really thought I was doing my lawn a favor. But after recording this video of me mulching my maple leaves, I read an article that says that maple trees try to kill the grass too. Surprisingly, most cool season lawn grasses are also aleopathic and fight back with chemicals of their own. So there really is a war going on under my maple tree. Trees and grass just don't get along very well, and trees win the war more often than not. I suppose that having a nice lawn under a big leafy tree is actually an unnatural occurrence. But I really like the look of grass growing under trees. It looks natural to me. Much more natural than a man-made tree ring, mulch volcano, or any other kind of planting under a tree. That's my personal opinion and my preference, so I do as much as I can to help the grass grow under my tree. It really bums me out now to discover that I've been helping my maple tree beat up on my grass. I don't enjoy bagging leaves and carrying them out to the curb to be composted, but next year I just might do that. There still seems to be quite a debate going on in the scientific world and the lawn and gardening world about how significant this battle between lawns and trees really is. But it's not very hard to find a lawn that's suffering under a big leafy tree. Maybe a good compromise for me would be to blow the leaves away from the tree and mulch them over the rest of the lawn. The rest of the lawn may suffer a little bit, but at least it doesn't have to compete with the tree for food and water throughout the entire year, like the grass directly under the tree does. Sound scientific information on this topic is currently pretty hard to find. Hopefully more information will become available soon. In the meantime, We'll just have to give this some thought and try to figure out what works best for us on our own. I'm not worried about getting every leaf mulched right now, because there are many more leaves to fall, and I'll have many more opportunities to get them all before winter arrives. Hey, don't miss my next video. I'll have enough leaves for a full fall leaf cleanup by then. Until then, do me a favor and hit that subscribe button, and then ring the bell that pops up next to it. That way you won't miss the next video. Don't even hesitate, you can do it.